Hey everyone, Maggie here and welcome back to my channel. Today I am coming to you with my Swanky pre-order. It is the, what did they call it? Did I have a piece of paper somewhere? Flora? Was it the Flora? Flora pre-order. So nothing gets me more excited than knowing that I'm going to get a Swanky delivery. Her deliveries and packaging, I mean, they're, they're always just beautiful. So one day last week I had two boxes and I was thinking, wow, I didn't, I didn't think I ordered that much. I actually used a lot of restraint. And, uh, so I, I jumped in the first one and I pulled out a sampler and that I had ordered. And then I looked at it and kind of rummaged through and saw a, a body butter. And I was like, wow, this is a great extra, you know? And then I saw another body product and I was like, and it was full size. And I was like, no way, no way. So I, I looked through it and it wasn't my order. So I looked in the other box and it was my order. <sighs> so um, I emailed Swanky and at first, you know, she said, I'm going to send you a shipping label. Can you send it back? And I said, of course. And, um, then she sent me a message. She said, you know what? Keep it. I can't send out the, the body products again. Anyway, you know, she's like, share it with someone. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I already have the sampler packaged up. I'm going to send it to, um, a YouTube friend. And I'm gonna show you everything else. And I'll show you the sampler because I ordered one uh, for myself as well. But um, I have some friends who are interested in vendor wax. They've never ordered. So I'm gonna split some of these up between them. And I haven't figured out what I'm gonna do with the rest. I think I'm going, to, well, I definitely know that I'm gonna share some of it. I've already stuck my finger down in the body butter um, when I thought it was um, a free gift. <laughs> so I um, guess I'm gonna have to keep that. Oh darn. And why did not I know? Why didn't I know? Why did not? Why didn't I know about Swanky's body products? Do I just, did I not pay attention? This body butter is amazing, but okay. So what I'm gonna show you first is what I got in the oops delivery, I guess. Um, let's see, there were some samples. Let's see here. Okay, I think there were four samples. So the first one is a Golden Sands Pink Sugar and Bare Vanilla. Now, even her samples are stunning to look at. Look at this rose. I mean, her presentation is top notch. This is a beautiful body care type scent. The bare vanilla is beautiful. It's warm. I think it's the golden sands. It's not like sweet pink sugar by itself. It's just a really mature, really beautiful scent. I love that. I share a lot of my samples with my mom. Um, strawberry sweet on Paris and cotton candy frosting. And this was just a small chunk and it's devoured. It was kind of warm when the stuff got delivered. And this is a great cotton candy, a very st sweet strawberry cotton candy smell. Uh, Baccarat Rouge 540. Yeah, and this is a perfumey. I've never, per perfumey, I've never smelled the perfume, the actual uh, perfume, but I've had it from a lot of vendors in wax and it is a mature perfumey smell. And then I have Cozy Mittens Strawberry Pound Cake. Okay, now Cozy Mittens is a blend of hers. Is it a Palo, is it like a Palo Fireside type blend? Look at that, isn't that beautiful? Yeah, this is really, really good. I, I definitely like this. I'm kind of thinking Cozy Mittens is a Palo uh, Fireside type blend. Okay, then, Look at her body products come packaged like this. If you ever want to give a body product as a gift, I mean, the packaging is beautiful. And the scent that I got, well, that was sent, um, is in Lily. I don't know if you 
can see how thick, how thick that is. I mean, I've got to dig my finger in there. And then it's, it's, it is, um, it's not gre real greasy or oily. Um, super, super thick. And a little bit, I think, goes a long way. You can see my fingerprint in there. And this is just a really light um, floral. Probably smells like lily. Not overly perfumey. Very soft. I am definitely going to order some body butter from the next pre-order. And then there was another body product. A cute bag. And this, and then she's got it wrapped in the bubble wrap. And it's also in Lily, and it's a body wash bubble bath. Yeah, and it's just a really light Lily scent. It's beautiful. It's really, really nice. So, yeah. Oh man, that body butter just smells, or just feels fantastic. Okay, so I thought those were awesome. Then there were three tins, three of her tins. This one is in Snuggles Pink Sugar. This this turned really powdery. The pink sugar and the, when it says Snuggles, I don't really know what Snuggles is. At first I thought it was like a Snuggle um, laundry dupe, but I'm not so sure about that right now. But you can see, this, this is very powdery. So I'm going to, um, I can, I can probably, I'm going to probably cut that in about four pieces maybe and share with some friends. The next one was Sweet on Paris Sugared Roses. You can see she's got the beautiful dried flowers. I'm not going to take this one out because I don't want it to get all over. Um, this is light on the rose. Sweet on Paris is um, it's like a lemon and blackberry. And this, the the Sweet on Paris really tones down this rose. You get, a, I get the lemon. I think this is really, really pretty. But like I said, I'm going to cut this up and share. And then this one is Wild Rose, Strawberry, and Fresh Green Grass. Got some more dried flowers on this one. Okay, so when I smell this, I smell dirt. I, I do. I smell some dirt in here. And then I think what I what it is, is, and this is a beautiful grass scent. This is like fresh, real. This isn't any kind of um, imitation or artificial type smell. It's almost like you're, you bend over to smell fresh planted flowers in wet, wet dirt. Maybe the grass is wet and you you get down there. And that's what this smells like. Yeah. I like this one, but I'm gonna cut this one up and, and share it also. Well, I'm gonna cut all these up and share. So then maybe some of my friends will experiment with some vendor wax from now on. Then there was a bag of strawberry milkshake, sweet on Paris and strawberry pound cake. Now, she does not have pour dates on her labels. This is really pretty. This, you know, I get that summer scoop type strawberry from this, and I don't usually ever get that from a strawberry pound cake blend. This was filled with um, diamond shapes, kind of three-dimensional hearts, and then smaller diamonds. This is really, really good. I think I'm gonna throw some of this. I was sending the sampler to a YouTube friend and I didn't get it sent out yesterday. So I'm not gonna send it today or tomorrow. I'm gonna to wait till Monday because of the heat and stuff for the weekend. So I think I'm just gonna fill the bag up with, with some more stuff. I don't think she's crazy about perfume type scents, but maybe I'll just send them, give them a try. Let her give them a try. Um, let's see. This one is Ghost Flower, Lily Blue Lotus Flower, a touch of clean white soap and crystal blue spa. And 
and yeah, this, um, this smells, I can smell the lily because it reminds me of the body care. So that must be what I'm smelling. But there are just all kinds of different flower shapes, little closed rosebuds, just some little, just super, super cute. Yeah, you know, this is um, the lily with a little bit of a soap note. This is really pretty. I mean, it's really, really pretty. Yeah, I've got to get all of that cut up. And then there was a loaf in blueberry sugar, cookie dough, and waffle cone. Her loaves are stunning. And this is good. Um, the blueberry is pretty good. She does a blueberry Fruit Loops that is my absolute favorite blueberry. This is going to, let's see if I can take it out by holding on this way. There you go. You can see all of those. Whoops. Isn't that stunning? And then there's chunks throughout it. Her wax is pretty soft. Yeah, this is good. It's like a... It's like, <coughs> oh, sorry. It's like opening up, opening up a can of blueberry pie filling. That's what I get from this. Yeah. I hate to get into that one and destroy it. Okay. Then there's the sampler. Now, she had a sugar cookie sampler, sampler and a summer scoop sampler that I purchased. This is the sugar cookie one. And this is mine. This is the one that was in my box. The one that was in this box is already packaged up. Let's see what we've got here. Okay. So we've got pink velvet, sugar cookie, and all of these are hearts. Um, yeah, this is, it's sweet because of the sugar cookie, but the pink velvet definitely has a perfumey note to it. Kind of, I get, I get both notes pretty equally there. Fireside cream cake, sugar cookie, and toasted mallow. I love her fireside cream cake. Yeah, and this definitely has, oh, it definitely has that fireside note. I love her fireside. It's not too much. Oh, this one is beautiful. I love this one. Okay. Lemon ice box meringue, sugar cookie, and waffle cone. Yeah, it reminds me of lemon, lemon chiffon, little strawberry shortcake doll. Yeah, this one's good. I, I can't pick out waffle cone a lot. Um, definitely a nice lemon bakery though. Raspberry jam, bougie vanilla, and sugar cookies. Isn't her bougie vanilla a little bit of body care, kind of body care-esque vanilla? Because this one, to me, this has some chunks in it. Yeah, this is okay. This is good. Definitely raspberry body care, I think. But it's, it's nice. Blackberry sugar cookie and buttercream Noel. Hmm. This is, ooh, we got some yellow chunks. This one's pretty light, but definitely blackberry. I don't know what you consider the Noel, buttercream Noel. This one's a little on the lighter side to my nose. Blueberry sugar cookies. Yeah, and this is blueberry. 
These were kind of soft when they got to me. That's just a plain blue. Um, now, I like the other blueberry better than this one. This is, this is kind of artificial blueberry. Okay. Pink sugar cookies and marshmallow Noel. Oh, this one's pretty. It's got a little bit of glitter on it. That one. Oh. Hmm. Pink sugar cookies. It's pink sugar. It's really weird. You know, I was expecting these to be more bakery because of the sugar cookie, but I don't I don't get bakery from some of them. The lemon I definitely did. But this one, I I don't. You know, I get um kind of body care. Sweet. And then the last one, strawberry rhubarb sugar cookie and waffle cone. Okay, I get the strawberry rhubarb and I like that note. It's not real strong. Oh, well, I'm just, I just dropped wax on the floor. This one's got some chunks too. Yeah, this is a sweet strawberry with a little bit of that tart rhubarb. And then I really honestly, I can't pull out the sugar cookie or the waffle cone. You know how in some blends you can pull out like a sugar cookie royale easily? I can't, but it's a nice strawberry. And then, like I said, there's a tart rhubarb. So that is what I got in my oops order or oops delivery. So I am definitely going to pay this forward and share all of these goodies with some people and maybe, you know, generate some more business for Swanky. And I know with this body care, that is definitely going on my order for the next pre-order. So my order from Swanky was, of course, the sugar cookie sampler. Um, I did get some more samples. Let's see what we got here. Okay. I got tobacco leaves. This, I adore. I love this. Okay, this is so nice. It is not like smoky, you know, don't think tobacco. It doesn't smell like a pipe. It doesn't, it's almost um, cologne-ish. Uh, I don't even know how to describe it. Maybe a little woodsy. I don't know, but it's amazing. I love that. I got a Baccarat Rouge 540. I definitely share that. I got strawberry rhubarb sugar cookie, which is what we got in the sampler, but I think that one might have had waffle cone. Yeah, this one's really light. That's really light, but we had it in the sampler. And Scarlet's Boudoir. I know I have Scarlet. Um, this is floral, a little perfumey, but nice. That's really nice, actually. Mature. I think it's mature smelling. Okay, and then I got a body, body butter sample in kimono flower. Let's look at this. Cute little bags. This is light. Um, I think I like Lily better. I don't know, this is kind of smells like a, a watery note. Not really aquatic. I don't, you know how a lot of times with aquatic smells you just think blue. It's, it's not like a, <sighs> hmm. Yes, this is nice. I will definitely use it. And like I said, I am definitely, definitely getting into her body care next order. Then I got a body spray in kimono flower. And it comes in a little vial like this. 
It doesn't have a spray on it, but it does have this little, little opening there. So you can kind of tap it. Very nice. Yeah, and you know, this is a light smell. It's nice though. The longer I smell this, the more I like it. Hmm. Very nice. So I am super excited about the body care items. Uh, first I will do my loaves. I got Violet and Birch. And this is... This is a lot more perfumey than I was thinking. Look at that. This, uh, it's all one color. I think for me and for what I like, I think if I mix some fireside with this, maybe a toasted mallow, I think I'll like it more. It's exactly what it was advertised at, but I just had it in my head it was gonna be a sweeter, Violet. I don't know why. But yeah, this is quite perfumey. I think this is going to throw hella strong. But I think I'll probably mix that. And then my second loaf is in Black Marshmallow Musk. You know, I think... Let's see. It says here... Black Marshmallow Musk is Palo Santo by the Fireplace and Fireside Marshmallow. Yeah, I love this one. It is a sweet Palo with a Fireside. Well, I'm struggling. Can't get that one out, but it looks like it might have black chunks. This is, this is amazing. This is my kind of scent right up my alley. Palo Santo, um, Fireside, Marshmallow. I grabbed Pink Chiffon, Strawberry Marshmallow Clouds. Oh yeah. And this one, that's the scent notes basically. But look at this chess piece. That's interesting. Little rosebud. Oh, isn't that pretty with like the, what do you call those things? <coughs> Sorry, I've had a little bit of a cough today. Here you go. What do you, what do we call those? Why can't I think of the word for that? It's not a brooch. It has a, it has a cameo, right? Cameo. Yeah. These are just beautiful pieces. Oh, look at that. Yeah, stunning. And this is really nice. It is that strawberry mixed with the pink chiffon and then smoothed out with the marshmallow clouds. And I'm wondering if that's like a boardwalk marshmallow cloud, which I'm really, really starting to like. Okay. Then I grabbed Enchanted. Queen of Cupcakes, Sweet on Paris, a touch of sweet raspberry, strawberry pound cake, berry cotton candy sprinkles. Wow. That is a lot. Okay. This one to me is Cupcakes at Tiffany's Heavy, but that's okay um, with the strawberry, with some strawberry pound cake. Everything I pulled out is the same. They're macarons, uh, little, little dots there. Mm, that's what this basically is, I think. The other pieces in here, just a little, I don't know what that's supposed to be. Looks like a muffin top, kind of. Yeah, this is really good. Her Queen of Cupcakes is a very, um, not really chocolatey, but kind of, um, what what is what is in it? Kind of I get a really, really comforting warm vibe from her cupcakes at Tiffany's. I think it's a little more heavy than some of the others. And then I got a sampler in her summer scoop sampler. And I'm excited to try these again because I did smell these once and kind of came to a conclusion about all of them. 
Okay. So these are all summer scoop ones. Summer scoop, cotton candy, blackberry, vanilla waffle cone. Okay. So I do get the summer scoop in this one definitely, and I get a lot of blackberry. Um cotton candy, I'm sure is a sweetener. Vanilla waffle cone probably just blends it all together. This one is nice. That one's nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna we're gonna go through them all, and I'm gonna tell you the difference or if there's a difference from smelling them today and when I smelled them last week. Summer Scoop Raspberries and Sugar Cookies. Okay, this one, I smell more raspberry than I do Summer Scoop. And there goes some wax. Yeah, this one to me is raspberry heavy. It's nice, very nice. Summer Scoop Blackberry and Pink Lemonade. This one is so pretty. I love yellow. Okay, so yeah, I really, I don't get Summer Scoop at all in this one. I get lemonade. Yeah, this one, oh, you see all those chunks. This one is very lemonade heavy. Okay. Summer Scoop Love Spell and Cotton Candy. Yeah. This one smells like Love Spell. I'm not gonna take this one out because the wax is breaking. It smells very good, but it smells like Love Spell. I don't get, I don't really get any Summer Scoop in that one. Summer Scoop, Queen of Cupcakes, and Fresh Picked Strawberries. You get a lot of Queen of Cupcakes in this one, but I do get a sweet strawberry note as well, and I love, I love strawberry with cupcakes at Tiffany's. So this one's really good. I do get some Summer Scoop on the bottom, but it's just a really sweet strawberry mixed with the cupcakes at Tiffany's. This one's very good. Okay. Summer Scoop Mango Sorbet Orange Dream Sickle and Waffle Cone. A lot going on there. Ooh, mango. Mango and orange. Look at that. It's a very nice mixture, like a fruit medley type mixture. Yeah, I definitely get a little bit of the dreamsicle note too, but it's, it's underlying. It's just a really nice fruity blend with a little bit of the dreamsicle. Okay. Summer Scoop Peach Cotton Candy Vanilla Cake Pop. This is, this is peach heavy. And then on the bottom, I definitely got a ton of peach on the top. I don't know. On the bottom, I might get some of that summer scoop mixed with the vanilla. It's a, it's a toned down summer scoop. This one is nice. I'd be interested to see how that one performs. And Summer Scoop, Pink Frosted Cake, Blueberries, Vanilla Bean Noel. It's another pretty one. Whoa. Um, this is blueberry heavy. Yeah, this, I don't get any Summer Scoop in this one. I get blueberry. Yeah. I mean, it's, it's an okay blueberry. 
but I don't get, I don't get like a fruit medley kind of, kind of scent. I just get strong on the blueberry. So there wasn't a big difference from the first time I smelled the sampler till now, but the first thing I thought was summer scoop is not the star of this sampler. And a lot of times, um, that's kind of what you get, you know, um, summer scoop is not the most dominant note in, in most of these blends. I think there was only one that was really summer scoop heavy and all the others weren't. So I just thought that was kind of strange. Uh, they're all good. I can't wait to melt, melt, bleh, melt them. Um, I love Swanky. I so look forward to her pre-orders and I love getting Swanky packages. And if anyone from Swanky is watching, I will definitely pay it forward with this second box and, um, you know, maybe, um, I, I don't think that person's got to try Swanky. Um, if she has, it's just a, maybe a, a few things. I've never seen a haul or anything like that from her on Swanky. So, you know, maybe she will become a Swanky lover like me. So anyway, thanks for stopping by and seeing, um, what I got and I hope everyone has a great weekend and see you soon. Bye.